Every object drawn in Chief Architect is drawn on a layer. Base cabinets are drawn on the cabinet's base layer, windows are drawn on the windows layer, etc. Chief Architect has a side window called the Active Layer Display Options to view and manage layers within a plan. By default, the Active Layer Display Options window is one of the three windows stacked on the right-hand side of the Chief Architect window. If you're not seeing the Active Layer Display Options window, you can open it one of several different ways. You can go to the View menu and click on Active Layer Display Options. You can click on the Toolbar button on the right-hand side of the Chief Architect Program window. Or you can right-click in any blank area on the toolbar and choose Active Layer Display Options. The window can be undocked and dragged anywhere on the screen or to another monitor. Simply grab the top of the window and drag it to where you want it to be. The window will stay there until you move it to a new position. To dock the window back in the default position, you can double-click on the top bar of the window, or you can grab the top bar and drag it to the side until you see the outline of the window. Once you see that outline, you can release your mouse and the window will dock to the side. If you end up moving the Active Layer Display Options window off your screen and cannot get it back, you can go to the Reset Options panel in Preferences and choose Reset Side Windows. When you have nothing selected, the Active Layer Display Options window, sometimes referred to as ALDO, will display a list of all the layers in the plan. However, when I select something like this base cabinet, for example, the layer list will update to show just the layers associated with the object I have selected. Notice how the cabinet's base layer is highlighted. This is the layer the actual object is on, and the other layers listed are layers associated with the display of that cabinet's base layer. So if I want to turn off the display of the base cabinets, I can turn off the display of the objects on the cabinet's base layer by removing the checkmark from the display column. However, if I want to turn off just the cabinet module lines, I can turn off the cabinet modules line layer the same way. This is a quick way to see all of the layers associated with an object. You can search for a specific layer as well. In the name filter towards the top of the window, I can type in a word or phrase, wall for example, and it will bring up a list of all the layers with the word wall in them. To get rid of the filter, click on the X on the right hand side of the name filter. Do be aware, this field filters within a current filter, so if you have an object selected and then type in the name filter, it will only search the layers associated with that object. The columns next to the layer name give additional details and control for the layers. The used column lets you know if the layer is in use, as I mentioned before the display column lets you know if the layer is displayed, and the lock column lets you know if the layer is locked. The color column lets you change the color of the objects drawn on that layer. All of the properties for a selected layer are listed at the bottom of the Aldo window as well. I can change the color, line weight, line style, and text style for this layer. Using the cogwheel icon at the bottom of the Aldo window, you can customize what elements of layer controls are displayed in this window. For example, if you want to not edit any of the properties of a layer, you can turn off the layer properties option. Or if you want to not have the layer set dropdown display, you can turn off the layer set controls. Furthermore, if you right click in the layer list, you can go down to columns and turn on or off the display of specific columns. If you want to hide the used column and the lock column, you can do that. Hiding these columns will make the overall window smaller, and you can then shrink it down to a smaller size. Also in that right click menu is the option to find certain objects by layer. If you want to find all objects on the cabinet's base layer, you can right click on the layer and choose find objects on layers. The window that comes up will display all of the areas of the plan that have objects on that layer. The currently active view will be highlighted, so you can click the select button and Chief will highlight all of the objects on the cabinet's base layer in that view. The Active Layer Display Options window is a powerful tool for managing layers and how they're displayed across all of your projects.